Today is July 1st, beautiful day in Australia, Central Australia. Today I want to talk about the uh, Droney, and it's also known as the Sophie. And today, with the essential equipments we'll be using is a mobile phone, the DJI remote, that we'll be connecting to the Mavic Pro. Let's get to it. See, most people think droney or doing a selfie with a drone is really simple. It's like, why, why do you have to do a video for a selfie or with a drone? It's just full throttle back and lift. It's not as easy as you think. All right, so you're gonna want it to be facing you, but a clear sight to throttle back, okay? And then you don't want it to be level with you. You want it to be a little bit higher so that the gimbal can angle down just a little bit so that when you throttle back and get that momentum going and then when you lift, you're still in the picture as you're lifting away. I like to have the full throttle back first so that I can have the momentum. Okay, let's check it out for my first attempt. And don't, and always don't forget to press record. For some reason, I lost visibility. All right, so here we go. We're gonna try our first attempt. All right. I'm gonna full throttle back really smoothly on the joystick and then slowly lift as we have momentum going back. But you must be going back full throttle with the momentum first. Here we go, we're already recording. a good one. Alright, here we go for a second attempt, okay? Because I think when we were way up there, lifting with back back throttle, it kind of turned a little bit. So, you're going to have to make a few attempts to actually perfect this, okay? So, this is going to be my second attempt. I'm going to full throttle smoothly back, and then I'll slowly lift, okay? And while, while it's while it's an angle going up there, about 100 feet up, you can start messing with the gimbal so that it can angle back down on you. You want to be the main subject of this selfie, of course, that's why it's called a droney. Here we go. Don't forget to record. Yeah, I believe this one is looking really good. I shouldn't be looking away from the joystick while I'm doing this because I could accidentally turn it. Joystick's really sensitive. Although I did set the sensitivity down lower. But uh, we'll go over there. It gives me a maximum flight altitude reach. It was a warning and plus it vibrated. All right, this time I'm gonna try in this other angle and this will be my third attempt, okay? Again, you're not gonna get it perfect on the first time unless it was like a built-in app or something. But uh, yeah, as of right now, the DJI uh, Mavic Pro doesn't have this automated. Recording and we're rolling.
I love that. The remote just warns you and gives you a little vibrate and just tells you that the uh, maximum altitude is reached. That's pretty awesome. All right, guys. Well, uh, if this video helped, click like. Let me know if you have any comments down below in the description. I'll leave some links as well for the uh, where you can purchase the Mavic Pro. Prices are actually dropping now, so it's a great time to get in on it since uh, the new uh, DJI Spark has come out. So, uh, yeah, until next time, I'll see you. Where'd you find